Okay, today I wanted to tell you about the wonders of emollient cream. Now, I'd never heard of this until I'd gone to the doctor's with a bit of itchy skin and he prescribed it to me. However, when I got to the pharmacy, it was cheaper to just buy over the counter, so you can obviously get it without being prescribed it. Basically, emollient cream is for dry, relieving dry skin. It works by helping skin to retain water because it creates a film over the skin. Um, it moisturises the skin, eases itching, reduces scaling, softens cracks and it also allows other oils and ointments and creams to enter the skin better. I don't know how that works. So it creates a barrier but it allows things in. I'm not sure. But it is amazing. I was a bit hesitant of buying such a big pot for some something I think I was going to have to use. I think I used it a few times. Possibly a couple of pumps worth for what I actually got it for. But I've always had a problem with dry skin on my lips especially. I have tried Vaseline, Carmex, um, loads of things. I've gone up to little stalls and bought everything possible for dry lips. But I, no matter how much I put on or how little I put on, because I know you can overload, it would always... I'd always just wake up with dry lips and they would split and yeah. Anyway, so I was looking at this because it was just sitting around being useless after I'd done it, done with it. It says relieves dry skin, so I thought, hmm, skin on my lips, I'll give it a go. Um, and it has been so good. I can't even, I can't even describe how much better my lips are now. Um. That's it, really. This is what it looks like. I've shown you. Um, I'll show you how it comes out. This is a cream. You can get oils. You can get ointments. I think there's something different. You can get soap substitutes with this in, with the emollient in, and you can also get things like bath bombs or something like that. Um, but this is very handy. Shame it's not a little bit smaller, but I'm sure you could find something smaller with it in. But this is how it comes out. You literally need the tiny amount. That that looks bigger than it actually is. There you go. Bigger. Okay, and then literally. And because I've checked it up on the NHS website. And it says you can safely put it anywhere externally on your body. So you haven't got to keep it on your lips. If you're a bit dry around, blah, 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 blah. perfect. <laughs> it doesn't make your lips go white, really. I look a bit pale in this light, but I promise you, in the mirror opposite me, my lips are perfectly normal looking. Um, <clears throat> so, if you have a problem with dry skin anywhere, I use this after shaving my legs because it says it's best to put it on when you've had a shower, dry yourself down and then put it on because then it locks in the water so keeps your skin nice and hydrated so it's perfect for after shaving. Um, Literally, smother your whole body in this stuff, and I can't see how much of a dent I've made to this pot, but I have a feeling I haven't really even made a dent in it yet, so we'll see. I'll let you know how long this lasts for. <laughs> okay, so that's it, my Wonder Cream. Go out and buy it if this sounds like something that could be useful to you. Uh, hope I've
been helpful. Let me know if you either have this or have something similar and how it's worked to you. Let me know. Okay, thank you for watching.